Good morning. Good morning, everyone. Also, sorry for the technical problems, the new platform, but I know one thing. If there are any big difficulties in the release of such broadcast, it means that there will be very useful information and very good energy. It is very important. So while we're waiting, people are connecting because updating the link failed a little bit. And before starting, I want to imagine what we are going to do. Today, we will be studying and imparting our practice with aromatherapy. And this is a very difficult topic. We will dig deep, deep about this. I just want to introduce you to my friend, my colleague. This is Nameda. Today, she is a hero with us uh, because she gave birth to a beautiful girl two months ago and today she came to share information, work with me and the child is downstairs with the nanny. So thank you for paying attention to us. Her information, her knowledge is very important to us. At this time, I will say I'm very pleased that you invited me. I have the opportunity to be here today and share my knowledge, share my experience about aromatherapy. We have a little screen sketched, uh, but we have a support group. This is Mantas, who helps us connect uh, all the equipment and Olga sits in the chat and answers all of your questions. If you have any questions, any problems, Questions on the topic that you want to know, you can ask questions during the live broadcast and we will try to answer them. So we are probably already starting. What are we going to do? We will share our experience. We will not teach anyone today because we are not teachers, but we are breeders who breed dogs and we have experience in aromatherapy and want to share with you. And probably before we start, we should introduce ourselves because there are many people who have not yet heard our seminars. The seminar is not about our history to write a book about. We will introduce ourselves very briefly in more detail. You will find information on the links. The second stage will be aromatherapy in the life of our family. The third is what is important to know about aromatherapy. This is a very important part about which there uh, is a little information because it is very ancient information that is permanent and completely new information that is gaining popularity. The group and I worked very hard to collect information and to show what aromatherapy is. This is also our experience, our knowledge and our practice. And the fourth step is the essential range of products that we have made for ourselves. So you know that when we dig, we dig deep. We use it for ourselves, on our feet, on our loved ones, because aromatherapy is the same, both for people and for dogs, both negative and positive impact. So we have uh, four parts, and we will talk a little bit about each of them. We're going through the part, and if you have any question, ask. Olga will fix it, and we will move on. Who we are. Who we are. What do we do? My name is Yanita, uh, my colleague, my friend, Nameda, and today we're going to talk about aromatherapy. I bought my first dog 35 years ago. Her name was Kika. I have dogs all my life. Of course, my children also grew up with dogs, and they had no opportunity to live without dogs because dogs appear first. At the age of 15, I bought a dog, and at the age of 16, I became a groomer. At the end of 17, I already became a handler trainer. At the age of 18, I had the opportunity to be the president of the Lithuanian Poodle Club. At the age of 19, I already taught groomers, and at age 23, I myself became an 
international judge, and now I have chosen the path of a breather. This is very interesting to me, and my children have always grown up surrounded by animals. Now my children also have children, and they already have children of their own. I have five children, more on this later. And here is our family after 35 years of marriage. Our strength is family. We have five children, three sons and two daughters. Daughters work as veterinarians and sons work with dogs or are still studying. Dogs are an integral part of our life. Those who follow our Facebook, watch our history, see what we are like maniacs who need a lot of dogs who are interested. And when we live with dogs, we see their needs. With one or two dogs, this is a personal experience, but when you have many dogs, you may notice a pattern of this or another breed and uh, what you can decide. So I love a lot of dogs. Dogs are a part of our life. The whole family does a great job with the dogs. When I'm not there, the children let the dogs out. Uh, there are also nannies who take care of them, so I can't imagine my life without dogs. And probably it is very important that I'm not only a dog lover, but also a breeder. I'm very grateful to my husband that knowing the importance of dogs to me, he built a large kennel which consists of three large buildings. Perhaps if you're interested, we will do a seminar or an interview about us. Write to us about it. And this kennel we call the House of Champions. Because one of the buildings is a place where only show dogs live. We breed Bichon, Maltese, Pomeranian. And here we should mention our victories. We are proud of our victories. We have 8 world champions, 11 vice champions of the world, 11 European champions and 13 American champions. Now our Svayunas is studying in America and why we are proud of it. Uh, for 30 years, it is an indicator that we are moving. We are recognized in many countries. We are probably moving in the right direction. And it's not even just pride. It's just the fact that exists and this gives us the strength to move on. Yes, we are on the right way. And our hobby... And my morning begins with letting the dogs out in the yard and the evening, having put the children to bed at uh, 11 o'clock, ends with dogs. You probably understand this if you are a breeder. And I am an ordinary breeder who deals with dogs as well as hygiene, excrement cleaning is all very important. And I'm doing this myself. We can say that every day you gain experience. The dog shows you something new every day. You learn with them every day. Yes, and this is a hobby. Watching dogs for 35 years has still allowed us to create products for dogs to make them happier and healthier. This is the most important thing. And how did aromatherapy start? When did I start? Oh, when I learned uh, aromatherapy 27 years ago, when our first son, Totodas, was born, here in the photo he is with the white dogs, the dogs were the first, then the children went. And how did we get to know aromatherapy? For two years, my son had a six phenomia and already traditional medicine, as I believe has hurt us. Um, there were no other options but to look for other ways for the children to survive. Because previously begin, the child was gasping for breath and it was necessary to look for some kind of solution and I started looking for alter alternative medicine. One of them was herbs and together with herbs I came to essential oils. That's 27 years ago together with the health problem of the first child I received knowledge that applied later in life. My next child grew up with antibiotics, so you understand. And realizing this, I began to apply aromatherapy for dogs. 
aromatherapy in the life of our family. Here it is a very important point because when we talk about dogs and aromatherapy, many people think why it is necessary to breathe. People do not understand what it is. When we talk about the family, our health, when I saw the illness of my first child, I was able to cure him with herbs and essential oils. Uh, then the next children have already grown up without antibiotics, only on natural ones. I realized at that moment that I am responsible. This neither the doctor or anyone else is responsible for my health, for the health of my child, but I am responsible. And only my knowledge, my dependings give this child the opportunity to live. And this understanding was carried over the following children and my dogs. Probably today it is very important to us to understand that the current situation in the world, this COVID, no one, no doctors, no medicine will 100% save us from this. We ourselves must know how to support our immune system in order to stay healthy, so that children are healthy, and so that our pets, dogs, cats, horses, this is a separate topic, are healthy. Here, we must already understand that our health, our personal health, the health of our children, loved ones, and our animals is our responsibility. And no one will solve these problems for us. And realizing how, how I almost lost lost my first child due to pleurisy, you have to understand what pleurisy is. This is when the pleura stops working, and now if this child fell ill with COVID, he would not have survived. We worked a lot and probably this understanding, thanks God that I went through this and I can say that no one is responsible for my health, for my loved ones and children except me, not a single doctor. The doctor can help, but I have to digest all the information through myself. The doctor can give medicament, but I have to think if this medicament is right for me. Because the first, the first thing that the doctors did was with my child was the doctors gave antibiotics six times the forms of which had mutated and the doctors th threw up their hands and said that nothing was helping and i was left alone with a child i then lived alone was a single mother after i divorced my husband and this child who is suffocating and you have to work with it because this is the only thing that remains. Indeed, I'm very grateful for this experience because now I deeply understand that my health and the health of my loved ones are my responsibility. And I am for naturalness because I see how chemistry or not always our medicine help us. And I would also like to add, I'm a new mother. How is that? Your first child is already 10 years old. Well, I became a mother for a second time, and it is uh, important for me, like all young mothers, that the child grows up happy with a healthy immune system and to heal him naturally. We all mothers understand this. And I want to repeat and straighten what Yanita said. It was relevant to her already 27 years ago, and now it is all relevant to all of us. The use of natural remedies is very important, and it is important for us as parents to straighten our immunity and so that our children are healthy. I also want to share this one experience. I think that uh, another way many will not cope with information. Every rich Jewish family had or has a doctor who always examines all family members. And the main task of this doctor is to prevent any family member from getting sick. If a family member is getting sick, the doctor is not working properly. You see, our medicine works in such a way that we heal when there is already a disease. But I look at it in such a way that we should treat ourselves, our health, 
the health of our loved ones and pets in this way so that they do not get sick, so that they have strong immunity, so that they can fight these viruses from the outside, the bacteria and etc. So I think we should have moved on, because here we have something to say and we will waste time. So moving on, aromatherapy for pets. What do we do in the kennel? We use our amar- aromatherapy everywhere. This required very deep knowledge and I will try to share this with you. But we are everywhere, both in cosmetics and in dog care. What breeds do we breed? This, I repeat, is Maltese, Bichon Frise and Pomeranian. And we use essential oils or mixtures both from infectious diseases such as cough and to straighten the immune system in the treatment of colds to improve uh, reproduction in uh, work at exhibitions, in work at workouts, uh, manage stress while traveling and during estrus. What else it is important to say? All information, all presentations remain with you. You can use it. We have collected a lot of information here, very deep. We will not be able to tell you everything today because it will take a very long time. But since uh, you are responsible for yourself, for your health and the health of your loved ones, we will give this information to you for you to study. I am for the fact that person that does that not take a pill or drops without studying what he is doing. He must be responsible for his life, must study, as well as the food that he uses and cosmetics and the medicines that he uses. Likewise, the alternative medicine that resources to should be also understood. A lot of people you write to me with questions that I try to answer you, and for this there are these seminars, trainings, knowledge that I transfer, because I cannot take such a large volume and answer everyone's question. We tried in this presentation to give you very concentrated information that you will study, and uh, then If you have any questions, you will come back to us and we will continue the discussion. This is probably important important information. So moving on. Essential oils in our everyday life. I can say like that. When we started doing aromatherapy, there was one technique. Now there are diffusers in every room. That means every child has a diffuser. A dog has a diffuser. I have a diffuser in my bedroom, a diffuser in the gym, and a diffuser in the living room. Why there are so many of them? Because every child has his own room, has his own diffuser when he goes to bed. Only essential oils. In the living room, we have booster and energizing in the morning, ev- uh, evening to calm down. Indeed, in the kennel there is always a diffuser in every room because I know that it gives uh, and this is very important. I will try to share. We will try to share our experience and we move on. We already moved on on the third part, which is a very important part. Before that, we studied a lot to make products and now we will share it with you. I can say this is going to be a little therapy, a little theory about aromatherapy, but it is very important to understand the basis of why aromatherapy is so powerful and so powerful powerful to our health. This is the foundation. So have patience and we will introduce you to the whole basis of aromatherapy. The basis. But uh, here there will be very deep material that we ourselves prepared because very often in the store you only get the labels and how it looks. But nobody digs that deep. We have prepared a concentrate for you and we are going on this journey together. So, the first cure for humanity. Did you know that the first 5,000 years ago, aromatherapy already existed, and these were essential oils. 
And these were the first cures for the disease. So you, that you understand, when we, we opened the pyramid, first took out the gold, but essential oils. Because essential oils were much more expensive than gold. And people, maybe now it sounds very strange, uh, we have a lot of medicaments and it seems to us that all pills solves everything. But then, when there were no medicaments, the most important thing was essential oils. Aromatherapy, essential oils have been around for 5,000 years. Then there was a break in history and there appear already in the 90s and at the end of the 20th century. This is already the first world war. There is a lot of information when doctors have already treated with essential oils, both the immune system and skin diseases. But I know, I read under the Queen Victoria, when there was a plague, uh, the plague was topped with essential oils. There is even such a story that robbers robbed everything, because during the plague everyone died. The robbed empty houses and places, and Queen Victoria, when they were caught, made a deal that they would get a life and freedom if they issued the prescription. And the recipe is a mixture of essential oils. So it is very important to understand that even then, during the most serious illness, people recovered with the help of essential oils. And now, in the 21st century, we are returning to essential oils. We understand that chemistry does not always help. Often, this is understood by people who want to live more naturally and have not very good experience with traditional medicine, as it, it was my story with my first child. And I also recommend watching the Netflix documentary on essential oils. What are essential oils and how they work? Not a very pleasant film because they work with serious illnesses, but I highly recommend watching it. Let's move on. Here we will stop at this picture and talk a little. On the left, there are essential oils from which they are made, from plant flowers, from leaves, from bark, from roots. This means that the medical property it has and what it gives depends on the individual plant. We will not teach everything, but just so that you understand what essential oils are made of, then processing takes place. Processing. How essential oils is perceived and how it is made. We see that water, steam is used, water vapor and essential oil come out, then it passes through the cold water, hydrolates comes out uh, of the water with essential oil. This is a separate product and a few drops of essential oil comes out. We then show how much a plant needs to get one drop of essential oil. Look below, one plant and to get one drop of this plant essential oil, it, it is around 100, 100,000 times stronger than the plant itself. You have to understand that uh, you are playing with how much one herb and one drop of this herb is 100 times stronger. Yes, this is a very high concentration. So let's move on. And what it is uh, an essential oil? Yes, we can say that a drop of essential oil has 80 to 300 valuable consistency. And it turns out that essential oil, when we describe our mixtures, we know that the plant uh, that make up the compositions, they have 20, some Sometimes 30 useful properties, different ones, one plant. And when we know that the most popular natural property is that essential oil straightens the immune system, prevents the growth of microbes and fungi, soothes and helps to relax, stimulates and gives energy, reduces fatigue, depression, improve, improves mood and many, many other values. 
These are the most popular ones. We will analyze one of our mixtures so that you see the ingredients and their effect. The benefits are great in every drop of essential oil. But all at the same time, you need to understand what kind of essential oils and what it does. And I know that today we are very good, we have very good achievements when traditional medicine does not help, but essential oils help. And on Netflix, Netflix, you'll see how it goes. But I even studying the medical literature, there are there is medical literature, uh, which with evidence shows how essential oils helps a person to survive or stay healthy. It is very important. And you must understand that the power of essential oils is 100 times stronger than the oil contains from 80 to 1000 synergistically acting phenochemicals. Each oil consists of 200 to 500 different ingredients. Here we leave all the information, but what we wanted to show is at the bottom. Each drop of essential oil contains 40 million trillion molecules, which means that this is 40,000 molecules every cell in your body. This means that the essential oil molecule is very small. It enters the body and acts purposefully. And if you look further, you can analyze the digestibility of essential oils. The molecular structure of essential oils is extremely small, so they quickly enter and spread throughout the body and are released very quickly to do their job. Uh, they remind our cells how to heal themsel themselves and leave. Essential oil does not accumulate in the body. This is also very important in contrast to traditional medicine from the chemical properties of drugs. Essential oil works at the cellular level. After 22 seconds, it reaches the brain, gives us a signal to the cells, and after two minutes, it is already found in the blood, and after 20 minutes, it affects every cell of the body. The effect is the same as uh, homopathy. Essential oil won't help if it is used once and that's it. This is not it. This is not a pill. This is not an eye time biotic. You should use it for a long time, three to five times a day, seven times a, a day. Repeat it intensity after a few hours, and then uh, there will be a positive effect of the essential oils and the effect of the immune system and every cell in the body, and reminds every cell to recover on its own. Very important information and we probably need to talk about it, how we use it. What are the three schools that we will talk about? Because many do not know and do not understand. Can be used externally on the skin, applied directly to the skin, such as magnolia. It is possible through massage or aromatherapy, for example, a diffuser. And now how we have added oils for transmission to feel the energy and internally uh, the use of essential oils in the mouth but in today's eu regulation this is already prohibited because there are so many nonsense um, but internally people use it what's more important is written here you cannot just dilute with water and apply on yourself if the oil gets into your eyes or burn somewhere water does not help it intensifies and you should always be careful careful with essential oils because every body can react differently it is necessary to try for example on the wrist to see if there if there is any allergy because every organism can react differently and you should uh, definitely try it before using. It is very important. Moving on, and these are the schools that I spoke about. Schools on how to get essential oils are English goes through massage, German goes through the breath and French goes through the mouth. And now we will show that English model is the using externally on the skin. 
And probably we need to talk about how to prepare. Что важно еще здесь написано, что нельзя разбавлять просто водой. They can be diluted with uh, vegetable oil, uh, what you take, argan, coconut, almond oil, and etc. And dilute the mixture or lemon essential oil and prepare the recipe for yourself and use for massage. For example, for children, mothers know that it is possible to lubricate the neck and chest if there is a cough, also palm and feet. Let's move on for dogs too. There will be Further of theory of how to use it for dogs. And the most important thing to empathize is that uh, essential oils cannot be diluted with plain water. Oil is diluted with alkaline water in a completely different way. There are distributed evenly molecules and such layers of oil is not obtained with the plain water. So it is necessary with alkaline water. Uh, uh, if you are preparing a spray as a disinfection for Wait, wait, the whole presentation is ahead of us. Understand that on the way we can talk a lot. So let's summarize. The English school is used externally, in the form of massages and through the feet, through the hands, wrists, so moving on. German. German is aromatherapy through breathing. We can supply oil through diffuser or we take essential oils and breathe. And it enters the brain after 22 seconds. These are the oldest schools. A lot of oils are used in Egypt. And the third school is French. And we had to write this because French have been using lavender every morning for bread and butter for almost 200 years. A couple of drops every morning and they use it because they understand that pure oil is much better than any vitamins and minerals. We will also talk about this. But the European Union or America, the health system does not want this to happen. And in order to swallow, you have to be very careful because if you swallow not pure essential oil, but with synthetic additives, or not understanding what you're doing, you may swallow chemicals, or you may get heat burn or burn your inner stomach. This is for information, you have to be careful. What should be a quality essential oils? It often happens that highly quality is expensive. This happens because pure and high quality essential oil, here for example rose leaves, they need to be collected 2500 kilograms to get one liter of essential oil. And so we know that rose essential oil cannot be of good and cheap. I want to stop here. Now I'm dealing with uh, very ancient oils. I'm trying to discover still very ancient technologies that originate from Saudi Arabia, the Emirates. And we got the opportunity to use a few oils. And I say to my husband, here they put a wrong comma because if a liter costs 5,000, uh, 10,000 euros, it is not correct here. There are 45,000 here. We came back and we say, this is not right. No, they say, that's right. This liter of essential oil costs 45,000 euros. So good quality must come expense here. Because quality goes straight to our molecules and this is our health. Move on. What should be quality essential oil after all? And then there will be a little theory. It is very important here how these essential oils are divided and how to identify it. It starts with the D grade, which is the low quality grade. There are a lot of essential oils on the market and the cost ranges from 2 euros to 12 and 13 euros. And the buyer has a question, what is the difference? 
And the difference is precisely in quality. Class D performed class. Class C, it has been expanded. Its uh, composition has been changed. Chemicals, synthetic oils have been added. Class B is a natural food grade. Uh, natural, organic, and certified oils, uh, it may or not contain chemical impurities. The therapeutic grade is the highest grade, it is grade A, safe for internal use, pure and unproceeded. There are good quality oils. Therefore, in order to choose good oil level, uh, one must look to see what there are at the therapeutic level. No chemicals, no additives, and from trusted suppliers. But I also want to stop here and discuss. Uh, the first question that my friend and clients ask me, I will say you have to trust the supplier you are buying from. We still need to learn how to read labels. For example, the label might read 100% natural essential oil. What does it mean? The value may be as follows 4% essential oil is enough for 96 natural organic uh, oils, such as coconut, sunflowers, and you think you're buying 100% essential oil. Yes, you buy 100% natural oil because the base oil is 96% natural, but the essential oil is only 4%. And there are many questions here, because the efficiency is completely different, and if you use such oil for the diffuser, well, you will simply jam it. Because the diffuser itself, it lifts the essential oil, it picks up and lifts it into the air, but it cannot do this with argan oil. It will simply close this special mechanism, close and jam. So you need to understand which supplier you are buying your oils from. You have to trust, watch and observe. And also, we will give you recommendations of how to recognize essential natural oils. This, uh, this is point 3-4. The aroma of the plant and the essential oil must have an identical note. What it is? Very often we buy one essential oil or another, and we feel that the smell is completely different. Your nose, I promise you, if you use good essential oils, is simply one won't accept others. You will distinguish because your blood cell will interfere with the essential oil and it will not accept the chemical. What does it mean? You will have a side effect, I promise you. If you use good, high quality essential oils, you will immediately begin to identify. Your body will not accept chemicals. He will start sorting aromatherapy or perfume, a natural perfume. You will immediately understand where the chemicals are in the perfume. You will not be able to use or feel them. When you eat cake or ice cream, you will immediately feel the chemicals. That, mean, that means that consuming essential oils will unclog your cell so that you won't be able to take in the chemicals. You will, will become a master and begin to distinguish it. And very oft, often, it happens that if you take one scent and another from different manufacturers, different smells. It, it doesn't have to be. If it is cinnamon, it must be cinnamon. If it is ia, ia lang, then it must be that all over the world. It may be slightly different if it's different variety, but you will feel the, the chemicals. And you should always look at the packaging. Not just cinnamon, but the name should be in Latin name. How it is distillated or some kind of certificate. I also want to ask you, do you understand what, uh, what are we saying or not? Please write to Olga so we understand. And we will move on. Still, essential oil, how to dis distinguish them? 
на мета. И по-любому вы должны наблюдать на вопрос. Что я хочу спросить, вам понятно, что мы говорим или нет? Напишите, пожалуйста, можно, чтобы мы поняли, понятно ли вам, что мы говорим. Мы будем двигаться дальше, и эффективность эссенциал оля проверена хроматографией. Shown here is a device that has serious high-quality laboratories that invent and produce the essential oils. Move on. Before introducing the products we have created, Olga, can you tell me if everything is clear? Everything is clear and very interesting. Okay, thank you. So we have already received the theory and we are moving to a very voluminous part, our products. Why did we create them? How do we consume them? And there will be a lot of theory here. We will skip it but it was made for you that so you can study you must understand why such mixture what ingredients what each ingredient gives we have collected a lot of information for you and give it to you so that you can understand and work yourself if you're interested so what prompted us to create a line of essential oils We have a lot of dogs, we have a big family, we travel a lot, we travel a lot to exhibitions. We are a very active family and we need a shield, a large shield so that we can move across other time zones and we have a good immune system. And the goal of creating our products is strong, healthy pets. What we use in the kennel and share our experience of how we do it. It is probably very important to understand why I choose this way for pets, because it is not easy. Natural therapy is longer, but its effect is much greater. If our medicine has a very quick, uh, efficient effect, but the action is rather short, then the natural way works with the immune system. And I must share my experience of how I got to the second wave with animals. We have created a central oil product line. The first for health. The second is parasite prevention. The third is for the home and the fourth is for cosmetics. Why did I start to move on the second circle with health? Here is a very interesting diagram, you need it, uh, because as a person has all points in the palm of his hand, so a dog, a cat has all points. When influenced by applying essential oils or a massage with essential oils to give a very good effect. So we we'll leave that to you. And here this way begins and I want to tell a story. The children have grown up, everything is fine and a couple of years ago I became obsessively interested in essential oils. One dog handler came to me and in conversation she said that she cured her cough in two days with kennel cough oil. Wow, I thought, incredible thing. I've gone through so much, done so much. In Germany, people are working and doctors are working, all the new technologies. But still, I accept all the information and ask her to give this essential oil. And to my whole experience that I have, in three days, we cured a cough that did not go away for six months. And I realized that here I have to dig very deep because my knowledge was 27 years ago and with the several oils, I need to go deeper. I realized that uh, no one would help me with my dogs. With natural medicine, I have to change something because we are very active. We exhibit a lot. Our dogs come and go for rent, dogs walk and so on. So I started to go deeper. And this kennel cough Show me once again the way. I came back with a renewed vigor to find out and to do the very best for my dogs. And we got kennel cough. It was with uh, Copaiba, but during this time we improved and added four more ingredients. 
and the result is a kennel cost product that can be used with a diffuser or through the, the heels. Where else do we use it? We use it for any incomprehensible cold. We do not know, uh, we often leave, especially Spitz, often leave star coughing. Even when transported to another country, he begins to cough from stress, from everything, and we always have this remedy. And immediately on his heel, on the coat, so that he begins to breathe and very quickly regenerates. The composition is written here. We will not talk about this, but this information is very important. This is your homework, to read and study, study all of this. So moving on, in the kennel we use it as a prevention. We have six doctors who work in the nursery because uh, we are 24-7. We have doctors every day, we do not have days off for doctors, we need a team. And in the rooms they, they live, we use it. Next, here is this product about which we will talk a lot. This is the fur growth. We can say this product is the flagship of the entire essential oil line, so we pay special attention to it. This product, like for dogs, we create it for dogs, but we understand everything. Yanita and I especially understand that the plants uh, that are part of our mixtures are the same essential oils and we use such quality of essential oils, therapeutic suitable for both human and dogs. And for animals in general, not just dogs. And it turned out that using it on dogs and seeing the positive effect, how the hair grows and etc., we thought why not use this tool itself because for for a woman, the main pride is here, and we used this mixture and got a very positive effect. And a lot of people, colleagues who have tried and already know that this mixture is very effective. And I must say that it contains four ingredients, rosemary, lavender, cedar and sage. And these plants stimulate hair growth, they straighten the hair fossil, they promote the growth of the new hair and the healthy cells restore bald spots, improve uh, blood circulation in the head and the dogs. Animals, all skin, give the coat a healthy shine, deodorize, even because this mixture smells very nice and restores balance. So there are a lot of positive effects. And also, Yanita will tell you the story of how this mixture came out. I also want to stop uh, on the ingredients, why we are open. We wrote which oil we use. You can go in there and see. For example, rosemary essential oil. And you will find that rosemary is stronger than the synthetic folacy and regeneration agent. It is stronger than a hormone. Natural remedy is much stronger than synthetic hormone for improving hair growth. And we, I personally, first use the product on myself and then on the dogs, because my dog should be in their best shape, and I should try before they don't get any, any anything extra. And I can say that even at my age, my hair has never been so thick, and I am very proud that I use these oils. Plus, I can say that our company works uh, around 700 people and all the girls use these oils and even those who did not really believe and bought very strong vitamins for 300 euros i know restore their hair with this mixture so this is the basic uh, first blend that we use to restore coat how do we do it We'll cover cosmetics later in the chapter. Here you can see the composition. You can check the composition on Google and see what each essential oil provides. For example, lavender has a system, antibacterial effect and a lot of other ingredients. Sage is also very strong. Cedar and rosemary are very strong. Where else do we use it? When shedding and to grow hair faster and for myself when I wash my head this is once a week I apply this oil 
So the next mixture that we also start using for ourselves is stress relief. Just before the beginning, we don't, did not tell you how we formed this assortment. This all goes through the practice of Yanita. She is the main inspiration and she has these ideas. And this assortment arises as follows. A variety of problems are taken. For example, we have already seen in the kennel dog cough, coat. This is also very important for many breeds, not only for Spitz, but also relevant for women. And one more is not a problem and the situation we, we face every day is stress. And stress relief essential oil blend is a daily blend that every one of us should have to be in our purse and in our house and in our diffusers because there is a very good composition six different essential oils and very strong ones frankincense is the king of essential oils the same uh, vetiver uh, or sage or cedar or lavender we have already talked about it and they all balance our nerve system they fight stress depression soothe are very useful during estrus for animal and on travels in our every home i really love stress relief because you must understand, these six essential oils are not only for stress, they each have 20 to several hundred health benefits. And here we also uh, made the description for you. We're not going to read this, we'll leave it to you. You will study. If you want, check all the information. Because you have to understand yourself. Our goal is to inform that we have found this way, we are using these products, you can try and check on yourself how it works. The question I saw uh, you asked, uh, we exclude allergenic oils, rough oils that can have a good effect for humans, but we exclude them for animals. We don't use them. Then we go, and this is how we can use stress relief. This is when we go to training, uh, when we go to the veterinarian. I always give them the dogs fly in the boxes in the front of the cargo, because not all the dogs I can take into the cabin, for example, Bichon. And I always have stress relief. Plus, I always have stress relief at the show because the dog can just get nervous about the nearby dog because of the noise and so on. And I may need it. That doesn't mean I always use it, but I, but I always have stress relief in my bag. I have a roller and apply it when I need it. This is a very convenient package. Stress relief is also in a pencil roller. Move on. It is a very good blend of oils, emotional support. We use it in our offices when we work and indeed it works great. Once uh, we've dealt with stress, we need to cheer ourselves up. Emotional support is a blend of essential oils that lifts the mood, also relieves stress, relaxes and smells very nice. If you see the composition and if you already know a little bit more about aromatherapy, then you will know that Ilang Ilang is a very good essential oil. It is an aphrodisiac for women. This oil is very high quality and expensive but it smells very nice together with grapefruit, bergamot and also with cedar. And it turns out that when used in a diffuser, you will have a very good smell in your room. And that's why we use this mixture both in the office and at home. Because it is very neutral and you can evaporate these mixtures from morning to evening and for dogs too, so that they are charismatic, so that they have a good mood, so that they are inspired, you can use it in the same way. Evaporate in a diffuser. You can, it can be applied on the palm's feet. I also want to discuss, I remember when I began to study products, essential oils, a lot of this is written here. Emotional, for men it gives some incomprehensible properties. And then when we start to release our mixtures, I understand why they do this. 
practice. It is forbidden to use essential oils as medicament to improve health. This according to the regulation. Why it is done? because information rules. We see the situation with COVID. Information rules. It closes the whole world. Information rules us. And we must understand that we need to survive. And when you start digging, why I urge to, for you to study, I even speak benefits in English, uh, you will see that each of these oil gives a very wide range of solutions for your questions. For example, bergamot and grapefruit are very po powerful antidepressants. It must, uh, it's much stronger than the antidepressant and you might be drinking because you need to. You just try it and you will see how. Without noticing it yourself, you will have a great mood. Plus, you get a whole body improvement from each oil. Further we go. The whole roaster is here. Properties. You will study this if you like. A mixture of essential oils, microbe shield. Yes. This is a different mixture. We created it years ago when this situation with COVID arose. It was all new. There was such a panic. We know that uh, when there was the first wave, there was a lot of stress, a lot of ignorance. We did not know what awaited for us, how long we would stay at home, how strong this virus was, how not to get sick, and so on. And it was at this time that we created, it was the impulse and inspiration of Yanita, we created this mixture, Microbe Shield. The original goal was to retain our entire staff. We were responsible for the families of our employees, and we prepared this mixture exactly on the weekend. Uh, we mixed all this to give people, our people, so that they protect themselves and their families. Also, a very strong composition, a very targeted composition for fighting germs and viruses. What did we do with this mixture? We all took alkaline water, added 10-15 drops of this mixture in proportions, prepared ourselves a disinfection spray so as not to use alcohol and still there was no alcohol and we made this mixture to protect ourselves and our families they gave them to their children and in such a natural way we can say for sure that in the first wave we did not have a single case of disease in our company. We recorded in the first wave when we had it out these eight kids. It was no, not only microbe shield, there was many more. Our 700 families, no one was sick with COVID. We are not saying that this mixture is uh, from COVID in any case. We work with the immune system. Composition and we we use it for dogs in the same way. Our kennel has a regular system, the immune system, uh, then the microbe shield system, the system for children, for the breeding dogs and so on. So we have a whole health system. Moving on, super microbe shield. In the first wave, in the second part, we were, we were all afraid and sat down, worried very much about my people, about my relatives, because we remember that horror it was, and nevertheless decided that it was necessary to make it even stronger in order to protect myself as much as possible from all viruses, fungi and bacteria. We made Super Microbe Shield, which has nine essential oils. We did both for for the roller and the mix. And here we got a very cool result. Even now we use. When something incomprehensible begins, a little throat, a little something, we immediately take it on the throat. In these places, on the wrists, on the feet, chest, if a child, then it's necessary to delete 50% base oil. 
and we breathe. Breathe a lot. And there are a lot of positive stories, stories of our success, that we have children and adults who use this remedy, recover very quickly, do not even get sick for a very long time, recover very quickly. And those who only look at labels help them much worse. Yaneta wants to say that if you believe, it is not enough just to buy essential oil. You must also use it uh, to get the positive effect. If, if you apply them and do it correctly, then the positive effect is guaranteed. There is all, all information of each ingredient in the composition. You can read, study, have it yours for yourself. You can try for yourself because we have recommended this mixture to many people. Many people turn to us from Italy and America. We send products and really I know that it helps both children and adults with chronic diseases. So it works. But you have to try and decide yourself. Going ahead we have light bread yes it's a very different mixture this mixture improves the functioning of the respiratory tract this is also true and with covid virus or with other diseases of the respiratory tract here i must say that i myself use this mixture at home because uh, if only my youngest girlfriend uh, who is 11 years old have something with a throat i take light bread vegetable oil, argan, or something else and smear those places which we have already mentioned it, neck, chest, feet, wrist, and so on. The most important thing is the places that work directly, the chest. But feet, wrists, pulse places with mixtures works very well because it is very well absorbed. And for a child, for my family, I always have this light breath in my first aid kit. And it has a positive effect on our kennel as well. For any incomprehensible cold, but I like to let the dogs go. They have to walk, the immune system must work, but some still start coughing. Outside, minus one, a little human, and that's it. Immediately put on light breath, copaiba, and that's it. I control the whole process, and my dogs go to bed with the diffuser. Wake up with the diffuser. If someone coughs and needs treatment, I do it with essential oils. And I can say that our daughter Mila, uh, we have two grandchildren, they rub oils in. Uh, they want to go to kindergarten and do not get sick. They go to the group, everything is fine with them. Here is the composition of the entire, entire mixture. You can find and read about beneficial effects of each ingredient. I want to ask, is the information relevant? Are you interested? Because we can go through the products and we can shorten it all. I just want to share my experience on of how these products appear, why these products appeared and where we use them. I would like to share, but if you're not interested, you write and we will just run quickly and you will study it yourself. Very interesting, relevant, interesting. Thanks. Okay, then let's move on. This mixture of immune booster, I believe, should be in every home. This is my recommendation because immune booster should be for both human and animal. We are therapeutic oils, we use therapeutic oils for these products, and we do not distinguish between human and animal because we believe believe that the animal is our family member, we are the same. This immune booster contains eight essential oils that are very powerful. Frankincense is the biblical oil, very expensive. It is both rosemary and sweet orange. And why is it needed? When we go to the rest in a different time zone, if autumn begins, spring, uh, when the virus begins, immune booster is a must. 
or we go to work and we know that co-workers are starting to sneeze, I always take the immune booster. An immune booster helps me to support my immune system, harmonize my condition, and I know that I have complete protection. This is a very important essential blend for our home. I also wanted to say, you see, we have products in the assortment. They go in the royal, uh, in the roller, mixed with the pipette. Why is, uh, why is this done? And we say the roller is always in my bag with me because it is easy to use. It does not need to be diluted with natural oils. This is a ready-made mixture that you can use everywhere. When traveling, when moving somewhere. And there is a mixture with a pipette, it is already used with a diffuser. And it already goes as a prevention of air in your room, in your apartment. And these two forms of release, they are made so that in the convenience to use these essential oils everywhere. Yes, it is important here that in, in a pipette you can use one, three drops. It is up to you how you use it, because immune booster and super micro shield are sharp, but in reality they act very quickly in case of any ailment, they immediately begin to work. These are very strong blends and I'm glad we have them. Further, the compositions of which we will not stop. The next product is show ready. At the shows, uh, the dog is very often tired and we fly to America and there is a different time zone. And we needed a solution so that there was some more energy and so that we would not sleep in the rings. Because when you leave for 10 days and when you have exhibition for 10 days, you simply fall. Probably the dog handlers know me who has been to the clusters. And uh, we needed to study who would help us recover quickly. In front of the ring, in front of the best, and we went out of great uh, shape both, the handler and the dog. Show ready helps there. At first we created for ourselves and use it. Our friends came up to us and asked, what do you use? We said that we use and gave it a try. Because there were cases, for example, in Malaysia, you have to go to the best show and the dog is asleep. I ask how much time she has. She has 10 minutes. I say then we will not throw the smell, but insert it directly in the mouth. We gave it straight to the mouth, for the dog is what was very spicy, but she immediately got up, regenerated, and in just 7 minutes she came up, she came out and walked. And this is a real practice. When the dog does not want to go or we, uh, I remember we were already lying on the tables, there was absolutely no strain. The exhibition is three to four days, and we ourselves we were only with essential oils. There is a lot of energy at once. I want to dance, everything is fine. So there are such essential oils. We've studied everything and made the show ready blend to increase uh, concentration at exhibitions, concentration at work. We developed a blend that works great. Uh, there is a composition here, you can read and see where we apply. We use it everywhere, at exhibitions. When we had the opportunity, we fly all over the continent and sometimes I look, change the time zone three times. The body simply disperses and essential oil helps us because the load is very large. And digestive support. To improve the digestive support track, why do we need it? When we go out very often or go with dogs, uh, walk somewhere or the dog ate something from the ground, we use oil for digestion made with a royal ball as well. You don't need to breathe them, just anoint royal uh, roller on your stomach and all the ingredients help to quick re quickly restore the digestion. Here's the composition you can read. And next, a very important product for me, mental focus. 
This is a very popular mi mixture、uh, among us because we have this mental focus everywhere in our work, in our meeting rooms, everywhere. And already the name suggests why. Because in a meeting we need to focus. We need mental focus. We take mental focus, and it smells great because the composition is very fragile. This is Iliang Iliang grapefruit, vetiver, cedar. They are very fragrant.、Uh, they can even be used as a perfume for women because they smell great. It also enhances enhances the concentration, stimulates brain activity, reduces. Fatigue protects against exhaustion and has many other good properties. Here you need to understand that we take a product for a specific purpose,、uh, for example, mental focus for concentration. Try it on ourselves, and then we make a mixture that gives not only concentration but also gives other advantages. And we use mental focus like this. This is a very thick blend, and I recommend always having it in your bag to improve your mood. To concentrate, a very fine mixture. And we also use mental focus at exhibitions. Mono oils. A little bit about mono oils. I must say that why we have them and why we need them. We went through one part of assortment.、Uh, these are the mixtures that we have pre prepared, selected the components, and they are already working. But another level is when a person studies oils, he takes mono oils and can、uh, make his own mixtures, or just apply one mono oil. Here is the selected assortment. We will now go through them a little. Here is lemon. Lemon. We know that this fruit itself strengthens the immune system, but so does the essential oil. One drop of lemon essential oil requires three or more lemons, and the concentration is very high. And one drop in the water you drink, you can vaporize it, make mixtures, and the impact will be much stronger than just water and a little lemon, because concentration in one drop is three or more lemons. I even apply directly to the skin. My wrist is not prone to allergies. I have no allergies at all. The only thing to be aware of when using lemon or any citrus fruit is to be careful in the sun. For me personally, eat three lemons or smell one drop. After three lemons, my heat burn,、uh, heartburn is already very strong. Therefore, what is the power of lemon and how quickly you can apply one? Drop of lemon essential oil, which is not very expensive by far, compared to the other essential oils, and quickly get the same effect from lemon, vitamin C, immunity, and antioxidant. Yes, vitamin C works really well. So the next mono product is fir needle, pine. Yes, this essential oil reduces physical. And emotional exhaustion. It can be used separately, evaporated. The spine three is made of four needles. Why is it important? There are so many pine oils, but I myself studied the range,、uh, and I came to the conclusion that fir needle oil is much more expensive, but it has much wider range of things we need. It's not just the respiratory system; it's much more. This essential oil can improve blood circulation in tissues, relieve fatigue. We all know how pine forest smells, and you can have this smell in your home. It relieves the symptoms of flu and colds. Conifers have positive effect on the respiratory system, as Anita said. It can also be used for skin conditions caused by dermatitis, eczema, fluorosis,、um, and scratches, and for the regeneration of skin cells. So there are a lot of positive effects, and they are very different from the respiratory system to the skin and to the pleasant smell of the pine forest. You probably. 
probably know that when we are sick, uh, when there are children, we have to walk a lot in the pine forest. And now many do not have the opportunity to live, especially now under the COVID, where we live in cities. And here we can take pine tree, breathe and get the same effect. This is a very good essential oil, you can read it here. Next, copaiba. It is uh, mine. This is copaiba. By the way, the copaiba, the recovery from the dog's cough began. And I really love copaiba. I think that everyone should have it in the home. We take it by mouth. There are a few copaiba manufacturers. It is very complex processing the technology. And there are only two manufacturers that I know. Because as soon as the throat begins, uh, we immediately take copaiba, two or three drops, and immediately sprinkle ourselves, uh, who is afraid to swallow. We do it for dogs, we do it for children and ourselves. You should try and check it yourself. Uh, we are responsible for the quality because we give it to our children and grandchildren. We see no problem. But if you are afraid, you can rub directly into the throat, right into the chest, heels and wrist. It does not rub. Practically... Um, odorless and has no bitter taste, unlike other oils such as cinnamon. There is no bitterness here, but there are many positive properties. And I recommend copaiba now with the situation that is happening in the world with all the diseases of the respiratory and the respiratory tract, and it helps a lot in other diseases as well. In the coat, in the skin, in the stomach, and in the diseases of the urinary tract. We have copaiba in every office, every house, and if we hear a noise, uh, then we immediately come with pipettes and uh, give it so that they do not infect us, and people recover very quickly. So I recommend to you, this is my favorite product, and it started my journey with essential oils. I love copaiba very much. And you can also add the copaiba is a natural antibiotic. It works very well and, um, against germs and bacteria. So in case of bacterial diseases, it can be used everywhere, both externally and internally. If you are afraid, you can... You can outside, and if you are not afraid, you can take the French model, two to three drops in your mouth and swallow with the alkaline water. If you still trust me, then take three drops down your throat, spray total mist, hold this mixture in your throat a little, and you will see the effect what it will be. It is written here how to use it. And Palmarosa. This oil is very multifunctional, both for respiratory diseases and skin diseases. It promotes skin regeneration. We use it a lot. It is rare. It is not found in many manufacturers because it is very difficult to obtain good quality. But we found it, studied what it does and use it. It is written here what it does and let's move on. Cinnamon leaf. Cinnamon is a popular essential oil and can be used in a wide variety of ways. For example, before Chris Christmas, you want the smell of the holiday so that it smells like cake. It can be evaporated in a diffuser. Cinnamon has many antibacterial properties and can be used to mop the floor. Just one drop and it destroys parasites, fungi. It can be used to disinfect all surfaces and can be evaporated. I would also like to say that cinnamon itself, you probably know, is used uh, a lot of with coffee, with other drinks. It is also included in superfood, just very spicy. And what we are doing, cinnamon itself, it lowers blood sugar, reduces appetite, uh, it's very important for women, a pound of it uh, is hard to eat, but we can apply it on the wrist through the feet. One drop 
is very powerful. And we use cinnamon in the kitchen. Here, this concentrate goes directly into the bloodstream and the effect comes very quickly. Eucalyptus globalis. Eucalyptus is also very popular, one of our best sellers. There are also many species and breeds of eucalyptus. You have to understand what we accept. This globalist helps with diseases of the respiratory tract, nerve system, also helps with the growth of the hair, against parasite, refreshes the air in the room. So let's go quickly. And we switch from health to the second part, prevention against parasites, natural. We have three lines from parasites and where we use it. It is very important that the composition of essential oils that helps against parasite is all sorts of flies, cockroaches, ticks, mosquitoes and other insects. And we use essential oils. Here you can read what composition and why. Insect Shield Fort. It is a very strong blend of seven essential oils. Uh, moving on, Asian style, it also helps with insects but also have very pleasant smell. How we use these oils? We take the roller ball in the palm of our hand and on the dog uh, when we walk. We use it when I wash cages, boxes, when I wash the floors at home, when we sit on the terrace, when the weather is fine, we put on the diffuser and put it on the terrace. If we don't have electricity, we take Torah mist, make a spray bottle, take 10 to 15 drops of essential oil and sprinkle it on ourselves and no flies, no insects bother us. This is especially true for those who live in the forest, who live, uh, who live uh, for the death. We have a lot of sport forests and, uh, and plants in Lithuania. Even in the city, we go out for a walk with the dog, ticks and other insects attack us. And why do we need to protect it, ourselves from them? Each of their bites can be allergic. For example, I'm allergic to their bites. I have an allergy for 10 to 15 days. I need medicaments. And I try to protect myself with natural remedies so that they don't come close. Here it is a must uh, to be added that the season is just beginning. There are three mixtures. You can use it on the terrace. Uh, you can carry the roller everywhere with you. Why three blends? Because insect repellent is a classic blend. Forte intestified the effect and Asian Shield did it, because not all people like citronella. This is the most important ingredient that the repels insects, and not everyone likes its smell, well, so that the buyers have a choice. I will probably ask the question, how to apply oil to pet coat so that the white coat does not turn yellow in the sun? We must apply on the palms and on the coat, on the ends, uh, do not spray on the skin. If you are making a spray, this is a 10 12 drops. The mixture of essential oils itself does not have any dyes. It, is, it has little yellowness, but it evaporates and leaves. And good essential oil, uh, even if it's blue, evaporates and leaves. One more question. Does it help against garden mites? This situation with garden mites is as follows. This is a separate topic that everyone is discussing. There is no 100% guarantee for any drug. I am for natural solutions. But one drug doesn't help. Therefore, we have three levels of solutions. We take a keychain of the neck, which cares of with ultrasound. We take essential oils and we make a spray when we arrive then three levels that we use personally in summer i live in swamps where there are a lot of ticks when we first moved i had uh, 12 ticks in one on one dog trip now we take a keychain essential oils between our hands we treated dogs came back sprinkle it and i have one two ticks per dog for the whole season especially when you live in swamps. I think this is a very good result. But we must not forget about ourselves as well. 
We use key rings for ourselves, for children, and essential oils. And from mosquitoes and from all insects, we use uh, these essential oils for summer. And let's move on for home. Very little for home, but it is still very important. For home, we have mixes. For example, Happy Holidays. Very beautiful mixes in which there are five components. A great mixture for home in the evening, in the afternoon. It is worth mentioning here that we have made these products not only for pleasant smell at home, but also for the components of these mixtures have a positive effect on your health. Yes, it is very important that a smell that is pleasant still has a positive health effect. So happy holidays! There is also mind balance for a cozy, quiet atmosphere, more for the evening. Mood 8, which creates a pleasant atmosphere, helps to lift the mood. It could be morning mixture, it is the composition uh, of this mixture. As in Zen. I love classics, I love Asian style, I am drawn to old essential oils, which I study a lot now. This is uh, not my last creation. As soon we will soon make such oils that will not only have pleasant smell, but will also improve the health of your you and your pet. I research a lot, and by the end of the year, there will be fantastic products. Wait for the new products. Evening melody. This is the evening melody. It is both a spray and a mixture. It soothes and stabilizes before bed time. Probably here it is necessary to dwell on the composition. Who travels to different hotels, there is already a small mixture of essential oils on the pillow side so that you can sleep well. And cosmetics include essential oils. And the world already understands that essential oils help us improve our health. And Evening Melody is a very good mix and for energy, energy burst. Essential oil blend is also for raising energy levels, improving mood, reducing stress, energizing and eliminating unpleasant odors at home. So it can be used in all areas of your home or apartment. Can be used for bedding for wonderful smell. Can be used and vaporized at home to wake up to improve performance. I even have this remedy in my toilets now because I don't like synthetic ones, I like natural scents. And the last probably product, odor neutralizer. This is the last product from the line for the home, but I would like to stop here a little because it is a great product that neutralizes unpleasant odors. It is very good to use in a kennel and in any home where there is a cat or several dogs. This mixture eliminates unpleasant odors. This mixture also repels insects. So at home you wash the floors, you have a wonderful smell, the old smell is neutralized and insects avoid. It also kills bacteria. Here are the constant parts and here is the visualization where you can use these mixtures. Terrace near the house, wash boxes, rooms with animals. We have a lot of customers who use these mixtures and are very satisfied. Well, diffusers. Assortment how to tell about essential oils and not to tell about the diffusers. Diffusers. We use diffusers for the safe application of essential oils. Strong but very light, uh, lightweight construction creates a slight foggy effect and diffuses the desired aroma in the room. Works especially quietly, intelligent and reliable automatic shutdown system. Disperses weak and strong water dust. And here it is also very important that it is controlled by the remote control can be set to one hour, three hours, six hours or more. There are so many models and these two of ten drops that you put in the diffuser take a very long time to evaporate and give a very good effect. They can also illuminate a room with different colors and therefore works as a color therapy. 
очень много моделей есть. Well, cosmetics. I understand that this topic was expected a lot, especially the, for the dog handlers. But our theme is ar- aromatherapy in our life. But for cosmetics, aromatherapy, you can do a separate course. There is a lot of material and we have a lot of experience. We have a fantastic result for dogs and people who have already uh, let go of their hands when no one has helped. Our practice has given very good results. Magic drops of nature elixirs. We have uh, to come to, to our topic, which is very important, not so much for the animals as for ourselves. What we use for ourselves and for our animals, two days ago we read seminar about cosmetics, this is a separate topic when you can dive very deeply. deeply. We begin. What are the elixirs? We use not only essential oils, we begin to look at what natural substances can then improve our skin, hair, both for animal and for us. We now have such a line for daily care. Uh, There is a first, a second, and soon there will be a fourth. And in the presence of skin problems that exist in humans and dogs, I see people, I see these dogs, and they are uh, like outcasts in this world. They have already been written off. And here we will show what can help these dogs, and we We need to do the maximum that we can change for our dogs. The first elixir for for daily care, I will explain this rule now and you will study it later. On the left, natural oils, there are seven. On the right, there are five essential oils uh, that they do. There are only 12 components. Let's move on. Here we have prepared for you a diagram of how the essential oils we have described. We have essential oils number one, two or four for fast hair loss and recovery. I use for spitz when they change their fur, when I bath them every week, also for Maltese Bichons. They are also get seasonal bath. We share the scheme, uh, we don't hide anything, our practice and you can use it. When renewing the coat, it is not just about the bathing. This is the preparation for bathing. We take the elixir, we mix it with Torah mist and add the conditioner, absorb into the coat and skin. Necessarily in the skin, always in the skin. You have to take care of the skin because the skin regenerates the coat. It is very important to understand what kind of cosmetics we use. This is a separate workshop, but it is very important to apply cosmetics to yourself and to the dog of such a natural quality that you can swallow. If you know that the essential oil enters the bloodstream after two minutes, then do not think that synthetic chemistry does not enter your internal organs. So preparation and basic bathing. It's moving on. Elixir number one. This is how we use it. Together with the shampoo, we add elixir number one and we use it in the bathroom. Elixir number two. It is similar but has some differences. It's already seven to seven. See? Seven natural and seven essential oils are also added to everyday care and the instructions are next. Elixir number two. What it does. At one time, such as dog came, we washed her. Uh, look, the skin w- was very dry, became like that. When applied, it was very important to absorb into the skin, absorb into the fossils, because they have to be constantly regenerated. As we get older, the bulbs get older. We are like grass. Now the grass, we have to comb it out. For constant regeneration, we must work. It's the same with our heads. We use it for everyday care. Here, from Croatia, for example, a fungus in the dog. We did the preparation, switched the grain-free food, and got the following result. This is all in one procedure. Elixir number three. If you don't need it now, just remember it. Any itching, any allergies, seborrhea for dogs or for humans. Collected here, five to seven. 
All of them work with the skin, regenerate, relieve itching. And now we will show our practice. Here the preparation, how to apply, it's just a diagram. And now we will show the result of elixir number three, an excellent example from Latvia, where Mark and Exler groomer and fossilized of this dog died and fossils died. They contacted me, we made Dermocom and put elixir three after two months, the dog was regenerating due to natural oils. The dog suffered for three to four years. Elixir number four. Full growth elixir. You can go, get more information on the right. Read. Moving on, we have made the entire full growth line. Here we wanted to present the entire full growth line system. With the cosmetic line, we now have the shampoo, conditioner, a mixture of essential oils and a spray. And this whole complex system that stimulates hair growth it works very well on the skin and here for the for your pets and you can use it for yourself this system restores bald spots stimulates hair growth improves blood circulation has a calming effect restores balance and repels insects because as we said at the beginning each essential oil has about 20 different effects uh, has a deodorizing effect gives a healthy shine to the coat straightens the Fossils. In this cosmetics, we do not mask but grow healthy hair, so the biggest work goes through the skin to make the coat of good quality. And here, too, is the success story of this complex system. We can see that within three months, the dog has thick, good hair. This success story is from Italy, and I'm very happy for the people who are fighting for their dogs in such way. And we consulted her, and there was such a result, and with full growth and some other additional products, we got such a result. A person turned uh, to doctors a lot, and did, did not know what to do, and with this approach, feed and for growth. The most important thing is a natural approach without any chemicals. We have already spoken here. Here is a shampoo, conditioner, spray. And here are the results we have with the four growth products. In two months, such a result. And it should be noted that people turn to essential oils when medicine no longer helps. When all the doors are closed, they come here. We said our doctor to to one conference on dermatology even before the pandemic. Treating, uh, treating allergies is very expensive, time-consuming and difficult. Doctors are taught how to expense it, it to, to treat. And here we can solve everything naturally, quickly. This is not what we have found in Panacea. We show our success in different situations in which doctors have no longer help. We go further and we have already said that we are digging very deep. Now they have invented a new technology, which is three in one, ozone therapy, milky spa, massage, bubble ozone bath technology. So moving on. Between ourselves, we say that this bath is a wonderful machine and even combines four in one, a bath, a spa, ozone, and a massage. It also helps with the daily care of dogs or cats, but it can also improve the condition of the skin and coat, treat skin and hair diseases, allergic reactions, cleans the skin and improve the absorption of the beneficial properties of the cosmetics. Small spot technology, it grins water to nanoparticles and cosmetics and molecules, they are absorbed into the hair and skin and grip, uh, gives a great effect during the treatment. You have to understand that this technology that when the molecule is ground into 
the foam when ozone is added and when you let in cosmetics if there are a lot of chemicals in the cosmetics then all the chemicals will enter your dog you should choose natural cosmetics because they are absorbed very quickly into the skin and hair by your your body and your dog and it is very important with this bath it is not only skin and coat when the dog is standing it is not only skin and coat ozone and essential oils are added the dog is massaged and the dog itself is healed we already have women in the company want to take such a bath because this bath opened the pores and all the essential oils come in uh, and ozone comes in this is a separate topic in general therefore it is very important to understand that when applying this technology the quality of cosmetics is very important so the first client who bought this technology a bath from us and uh, underwent training said that they did not get the effect why is there no effect because with chemicals you will not get anything the opposite will be the case because here you need to, to have pure natural cosmetics with properties that improve your dog's skin and body it is about such cosmetics that we are talking about we use such cosmetics we, we you need to be care, very careful in choosing the cosmetics you will be working with so we told you about the newest technology so let's move on our goal in cosmetics a natural ingredients responsible care gentle useful cosmetics cosmetic that benefits our dogs our pets humans and not only skin and hair Otherwise, we eat well, but the skin and coat are bad. Skin and coat are indicators and we add the necessary nutrients through the skin as well as through the food. What is the difference of our products? They contain natural essential oils. They are sulfate-free, silicone-free and paraben-free. Here we can tell why we have chosen this philosophy for our cosmetics. Because silicones cover the hair, it gives an artificial smoothness effect to the hair, but you don't treat the hair. They do not go uh, to another level so that the hair or the skin becomes healthy. They only cover and mask. The sulfates give a stronger lather. They irritate the skin, close pores, dry, dry out and weaken the hair. It is because of this what we remove from the composition. And of course, sulfates also contain cardicogen. Parabens are synthetic preservatives that are easily ingested and can cause allergic reactions. It is because of this they are not in our cosmetics. I want to urge you uh, all that we are responsible for, uh, that we put uh, in our mouths and use it outside if we want a good result. We must learn to read labels, not what a friend uh, recommended there, but so that it was free of silicone, sulfates and parabens. Because you can give good food, eat good food, but if you choose the wrong cosmetics, don't read the compositions, you will have big questions. Even the use of cosmetic and throw of hormonal balance. You are responsible for yourself and for your animals. Study the labels and what you use. I dig very deep for this, but I want uh, for you to dig and understand it too. I'm not a god, not menta or some kind of panacea. I share with you and it is important for me that you are the people who make their own decisions. Moving on, here is our line, the line of cosmetics. Sensitive puppy, the first shampoo. We have selected ingredients of chamomile and aloe vera. There are no more innocent ingredients for washing puppies. Hypoallergenic, you can also read shampoo for sensitive pets. The entire composition is aimed at pets who have allergies. Hemp infused, shampoo and conditioner for moisturizing skin and hair, contains hemp oil and cedarwood essential oil. 
Gentle Aloe Vera is a shampoo and conditioner with aloe vera with a perfect coat texture. The composition includes essential oils, sage, cedar and mint. Argan Power is a shampoo and conditioner for perfect nutrition when skin and hair need nutrition. Contains hemp oil, uh, orange essential oil, argan oil and citronella. Flea and tick. Individual products. We have already talked about uh, the antiparasite assortment. Shampoo and conditioner, which soothes irritated skin and works against parasites. It contains coconut oil, peat seed oil, citronella, lemongrass, tea tree, uh, eucalyptus and peppermint. The same ingredients purposely work so that your pet, which you watch with the shampoo, has a scent that repels parasites and works against, against parasites. Our technologies and experience are used in more than 50 countries around the world. So we finished. Now uh, there will be questions. Uh, please remind the title of the Netflix movie about essential oils. Uh, I don't remember at the moment. We'll try to find it. A uh, Netflix documentary movie. We will clarify. I have combined several questions. Are there any uh, conjugations for the use of essential oils and does the use of essential oils affect the sense of smell of the dog? Look, we are talking, uh, we have uh, removed all the corrosive oils. We only use oils that are gentle and good practice. But you need to understand that every dog is an individual and you need to try a little bit. Next question. Do essential oils affect the reproductive function of the dogs? Yes, they do. There are separate oils. We haven't made the mixtures yet. A few people start practicing aromatherapy. But there is a research, materials about essential oils. There is for harmonious imbalance, separately for male and female dogs, as well as for women. You can use fennel, generium, and ice oil. You can try, but you must uh, either use the products alone or in a mixture and breathe or through the skin. To be diluted through the skin with the base oil. For male dogs and for males as well, there are males uh, whose libido does not work. Uh, there are oils, black pepper, methyl, and others. If there are very strong ones, especially mini rocks that knit every, everything that moves, this can be controlled with essential oils as well. This is lavender, valerian, rose, and more. The next question is about the shelf life and storage of cosmetics with essential oils. I know that cosmetics with essential oils must be stored in the refrigerator and they have a very limited shelf life. How do preserve cosmetics with essential oils? Only natural preservatives. We are talking only about cosmetics, not about essential oils. Before opening the package, uh, until you open it, two years. Essential oils themselves do not have an expiration date. Because if in the days of ancient e Egypt, uh, they were carried away first essential oils, and the only goal, the shelf life does not matter. A very actual question. How can aromatherapy be used during estrus season to make male dog life easier? You show ready. Mental focus, stress relief or citrus lemon. By the way, we use it a lot. Last year in Orlando, uh, we began estrus in two dogs. We had 17 dogs and we lived in the same room. We used show ready essential oils and the male dogs didn't feel anything. Alexander found the film uh, not healthy. You can find it. You will advise one more question in case of Cushing's disease and hypothermogism. 
I'm not an aromatherapist. I'm a person who is a breeder, who digs deeply, who cares about my family, children, loved ones, dogs, so that they are healthy. But I can say that if you start digging on the internet on this issue, only show you the way and you dig it yourself. I know that many people treat cancer and diseases that cannot be cured. Maybe your information will help your friends and acquaintances to show the way, because we have to share information. Uh, if we have received information, we must share it. We shouldn't be closed. Perhaps there is a person who can become a happy and, and healthy. It is important. Another question. Useful or dangerous animal fragrances? I think we answered this question. Another question, alopecia. What is your advice uh, on alopecia? It is necessary to rake a lot about uh, alopecia separately. I'll tell you my opinion now. Um, it must be understood that alopecia is a gene that is not yet in the DNA and how many scientists are looking for, they are not finding. But here a lot of people confuse alopecia, nudity, excuse me, please, as a disease and uh, as an inability to control the breed. I ran into this with Pomeranian. The breed has reached such a level that 50 to 80 percent of the breed on its own cannot change teeth, cannot give birth, cannot, without human intervention, the first down coat. And when we want to buy a bear with a wonderful coat, because a dog, especially Pomeranian, must be such a squirrel for three months, uh, be a chandelier and then undressed, uh, this, then undressed like a squirrel. And what I'm leading to, if you breed dogs, educate, not just sell your dogs, also watch how the coat changes. Uh, there is genetics and we do not know uh, where something will pop out from. But first of all, see what, what to do. It's like grass. If the grass, the old grass, does not go away, then the new one cannot come. We need to help the dog shed its fur. Ideally, if the dog sheds hair for three to six months until a year, she must definitely change her coat. For this, there are mixtures of essential oils that help to quickly regenerate the fossils, but physically, it is necessary to comb these dogs regularly and wash them every week. I believe my practice is that when a dog changes its coat, it is necessary to wash and cope hard every week to help regenerate the fossils. The dog to grow new hair and open the pores. If the old coat remains, then uh, where the new one is, like teeth, it will die. And the shed life of this milk coat, it does uh, it does it for a year and a half, and we remain in the tubes. And already there is nothing to regenerate. There remains a naked ass. And there is a very often, not a genetic problem, but a problem of grooming the coat. There are the lines which themselves change. Uh, well, we cannot read 12 generations, but even this gene, America has been working for 10 years and cannot catch this gene. This, this means you will always be in this breed with the possibility of alopecia. But you have to work well. And for this, I personally found essential oils and we regenerate. We work with the mechanics, we regenerate, wash, clean, prepare. And since four months, we work every week, we work a lot and change. I can say that we have a lot of young animals, but all this can be done. You can't just throw the responsibility on the breeder because the dog doesn't change its coat. Well, excuse me, the dog does not change teeth either. And your children too. When, was, when it was born, did not know how to read either. So here you, the owners, yourself, must now understand what you feed, what you use. And understand how to work with the coat. 
And if there's already a problem, you need to see it if there's a fungus. What it is necessary to regenerate. You need to see how many fossils are left. There is a separate seminar here. I work with very hard cases, but we regenerate more uh, most of the cases. So try for for a year, for up to a year. Try to help the dog change its color, both white and creamy and red. Do not be happy that your dog is furry at six months old. At six months, the dog should be hairless like a fox and help with natural remedies. In my opinion and practice, they work much better than chemical ones. And for alopecia, how to treat, see Dermocom, and there is a necessary to regenerate skin and fossils. If a dune, a naked dog, has been sitting for three to four years, it will be hard. But if you try the dune for a year and a half, you, you can still regenerate it. Flea and thick shampoo works against parasites, but what if they already exist? Does it work? If it's air mites or substantial mites without a drop hold or tamazon, you can't do anything. If from flies, it will help. It is necessary to watch and identify which parasites. Parasites do not go one by one, which means they are in the ears and in the skin and in the stomach. We have an anti-parasite circle system in our kennel. A very large number of people want a seminar about alopecia. Counter request, send me alopecia cases, photo, age, history, because we only call alopecia that way. People also have such cases and many essential oils helps and regenerates the fossils. But here we need to understand at what stage you are, what can be done. I'm ready to share. I do not like to just give what I have told and uh, want to study each case, see what it started from, how it started and see how it works. And if give a recommendation, how not to only overcome alopecia, but how not to get it how not to get to it because uh, very often people do not care for their pomeranians or other breeds they say it's genetics alopecia i repeat the gene has not been found yet so it is necessary to teach people how not to reach the state so i hope the information we have shared will benefit you and your animals Hope the information was helpful. Uh, you have received both theory and information about the products that you can purchase for your pets and give them the best there is. We'll leave the entire presentation to you. We'll leave all this practice to you. You can watch, learn, try it. Try it. Ask questions, specific questions. You study first and then ask questions. I see that people do not want to study, go deeper. They want to get the answers quickly. Either we dive deeply and understand what we are doing or we just don't give pills. If you want to go with us on our journey, interesting and far, everyone will have to learn, both us and you. Give us stories, we will learn to learn, uh, we will learn to help, and you learn the basic products and have fun with it. This is probably the most important thing. Thank you. Write uh, that seminars you are interested in. We will be able to help you. Thank you.